Hello, and we're back. Playing Eternal Darkness. We've got orbs. Mm. I'm going to briefly recover her sanity, because I think we need to. Uh, but we're back as Alex. After being Peter. Ooh, even with a five-pointed one, it gives you quite a lot back. So, uh, what do we do? Do I need to find uh, these essences? Or? Well, we've just gotten an item. Two items, in fact, isn't it? We got basement key off that lady and the lucky penny. I wonder where we should go. Lucky cookie. I suspect the basement. Is that this way? Yep. This was the door that was hidden to the other guy. Ah. Now unlocked. Oh dear. Going down into basements is always a bad idea. But all the fun happens in basements. <laughs> Ooh. Pump action shotgun. Hells yeah. So to speak. I suspect we'll still stick with the melee weapon unless it's really good. That room. Wait, 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 wait. Explore the rest of the room first. Yeah, I was just checking if that's a room. So we have. Oh, an oh. item pickup. Revolver ammo. I can look at any of this. A giant safe. It's rather giant. Must weigh a ton. Large and old-fashioned. Only Alex had a stethoscope to hear the tumblers more clearly. Ah, uh, I figured she would be a tumbler user. <laughs> I was going to say, she just has to find a computer to hear tumblers. Yeah, see what's on a dash. Anyway, um, <laughs> enough pop references. Shotgun shells. Very useful. Super impact heavy. And there's something here as well. Yes. More, More shotgun shells. shells. As you can see, the uh, well is no longer full of jelly. Yeah, it's, it's now it's been, been closed uh, off. Yeah, it's been concreted over. Well, we'll see what we can do in here. Don't like entering rooms where you can't see what's in it. Mm. Oh. oh, I think I know what this is. Isn't this above, uh, underneath the room that's next to the library or something? Yeah, the house does sort of make a, a geometric sense, so you can work out what room's above it. Brass framework hangs from the ceiling, cradling the globe in the observatory above. Oh, it even tells you. It's an elaborate locking mechanism. Was this to lock underneath the way? Yes, it's, uh, I suspect, another passage to uh, Engar. So does that mean we have to do something in the observatory? Um, is that really all there is to the room? Yeah. It says we need something to get in here. Picked up a bunch of ammo. And there's this room. Can we not examine, like, that wheel on the wall? Or the thing next to it? No. There's still another room in the house, too. So no, we can't look at that. It was just quite awkward to find. Conveniently jam the lucky penny in place. And we yes, have power. That I was going to say, that's the room we can't get into. We hadn't been able to explore. Because it's is too dark. Just upstairs. Because I've been in it like four or five times and gone, no, still too dark. <laughs> it's just next to where that hidden paper Dover room is. Hmm. It isn't this way, it's this way. Aha. Are you not going to talk about how it's a wonderful toilet like uh, Maximilian did, which is isn't really it, weird. Isn't it posh to have a loo? Mm. Yes, we'll open the cabinet. Chapter page from the Tome of Eternal Darkness. A Legacy of Darkness. Yeah. You are not free to leave this plane until you complete a task for me. You are to hunt and kill the master of this house. Do this one thing and you will be free. Else fear the wrath of Uriah.
Everything is complete for your arrival, Master. Now we must wait for the planets to align, and that is not too many years from now. Another Roivus has crossed our path. This time, we will not be so merciful. Mercy has no place in this world. He will meet such a horrible death that the rest of the line will never set foot in his house again. Pray to me that they don't. I think we all know who that was talking about. Is it me, or is there a, like a face on the front of that medicine cabinet? Cabinet. Well, you can't see it there, unfortunately. Including hypochondria. Yeah, you can't really see it anymore. It does look a bit like a face. It's like a face to me. It's like a sort of a skeletal face. Maybe it's a trick. There's nothing else to look at. Maximilian's journal page. Hmm. Mm, everything's topsy turvy. Is that all that said? Yep. There's nothing else we can do in here. Do we just want to read the chapter page? It depends. Is there really nothing else we can do? Is that it? Well, we could examine the observatory, but I suspect we won't be able to do anything. There's this as well. Yeah, I don't think we've got the solution to the observatory. I think that's probably next. Do you remember what we have to do for this? Or not especially? It comes in time. Oh, okay. Then no, I don't think there's actually anything else for us to do. In which case, we should read the chapter page. It's a legacy of darkness. My education in psychiatry did not prepare me. I would love to see how Freud's view of his mother would change with the knowledge of Chaturga. How Skinner would incorporate Zelotath into his behaviorist theories. How Jung would accommodate Ulioth into his theory of the collective unconscious. Like my ancestor, Maximilian, I too had an interest in my family tree. As a psychiatrist, I believe that science could provide answers into my family's sordid, bizarre past. It was with great excitement that I began my search. The mansion's history was filled with my colorful predecessors. Everything from convicted and hung witches to committed madmen, each laying their own peculiar mark on its character. I intended to find their secrets. Which is trans cool, actually. I quite like that it sort of feels like it's all culminated in a, your grandfather deciding to be a man of science. Well, psychiatrist. Soft science. Man of science. Speaking as someone who studied sociology and psychology. I've studied sociology too. At degree level. I've studied sociology. <laughs> but yes, we are another Rivas. Less mad this time. Mediterranean immigrants. Mm, it's the same the book we read uh, near the beginning. I started, Edward. 
The darkness must be stopped, or all of humanity may end. Sets the clock to the 33rd minute of the third hour. Mm, and that ghostly encounter, we'll see you again next time.